Fishing all day in the sun really, it, it beats you up, but it feels good to be beat up for that reason. Welcome to day, it's actually day number three here, but video number two. This is pretty cool. My fishing rods have their own bed in their own room. I'm walking on sunshine. Can you make me a coffee? Yeah. Why not? I can't. Why did I even bring me a coffee? What? I don't know if I'm bringing coffee. I left it at the apartment. Oh, we left all the coffee at the apartment? Well, what did you have to drink this morning? Oh, juice. Do Walk isn't that bad, but the thing that's been the worst is these mosquitoes. We have mosquito bites all over us and they're huge. These mosquitoes aren't your normal mosquitoes. These things are the Megalodon mosquitoes and they hurt. They really hurt. Got bit on like the butthole last night. Oh, I completely forgot to keep my heads from the kingfish last night. So we're starting back at square one with the fish bite and the sand fleas to catch some more bait. I don't know how I forgot those heads. That's like the best bait and I forgot them. Finally got a bait. Finally caught ourselves a bait. Dang, he's a little fighter. Whiting bait, yeah! That's the rig. I'm fine. Right here. Get the bait out there for me. How do I cast it? Yeah, you gotta cast it. Chuck it. Hey, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Thank you for trying, buddy. Go, go, go. All right. Go. We have had zero bites on the big rods. Well, actually, we had we had one pull a little bit, but I, honestly, I think something just swam into the line. But we've caught one whiting for bait, and that's what's on the big rods, and that's what we got going on. These two dinguses right here have ate pretty much our whole lunch supply, so we will be starving. And they don't even eat. They they eat three bites of the sandwich like him. They eat three bites of the sandwich, falls out of their hand. Oops, I chucked the sandwich on it because I'm not hungry anymore. I can't eat it because there's sand on it. I got a sandy sandwich. So then there goes the whole sandwich. So our food rations are in short supply. So we're gonna need Miss Whiting to get on the little rod, that, that, that guy. Oh! Truth be told, we haven't caught anything except one Sea mullet, please tell me what this maneuver is. I mean, the ocean's that way. He might be like a turtle when he's trying to get to the, to the water. You're almost there, little turtle. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, he's still going. The first level I get blue. Where are you going? I'm not deep into the ocean. Well, don't do that. We need you, buddy. All right. Oh. Boy, that is gross. It is nasty. <laughs> oh no, I think we've got ourselves. Uh oh, he's skipping it through the water. Here it comes. It's a flapjack. So, we gotta let him go. Come here, let's see this catch of the day. That is a, that's a baby sea robin. Look at that, I've got wings. Oh, I wanna see it up close, get it off. Ooh. At those beautiful little winglets. And he's got little Jiminy hands. Can I touch it or will it hurt me? Yeah, well, what's that? You can touch it, but like they, they, they have, they have a very, uh, potent, um... Poison? No, not poison, just a... Just, I'm scared. No, baby, it's fine. You can touch it. It's just it's a really... A really what? Cute fish. Especially when it... Um, what do you mean, potent? Yeah, like when it bites you! Ah! Stop! Zach! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't, I didn't have the GoPro rolling. Team Whiting's back at it again. Dang, that's a good one. Good catch. So we have a few baits. Actually, no, we've caught two baits. We've only caught two fish today. Yeah, we've caught several. We had to get a return, release two of them. Oh yeah, we had to return the pompano. So and, and, the, and the one with the wings. Oh, the, the, the sea robin. So desperate times, desperate measures. I made this rig. Start right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, and then the weight. We're gonna catch a fish. Go ahead, put that puppy out there. Take number two. We have one, two, three, four, five. We we dropped down from the nine hook. We went down to the to the five. So go ahead, babe. Try it again. No, I want you to do it. No, do it. Woo! I caught part of your rig from last time. Or I caught. What is that? What is that? Ew. Some dookie butter on there. Oh shit! Oh shit! What? It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a jellyfish. Hold that! Hold that! Hold that! I gotta get this on. So, I have no clue what of that y'all caught or what Amanda got on video of that, but so pretty much I was reeling in the line and there was a jellyfish on it. It wouldn't come off. I've never had this really happen before. It got on the spool, so I was spinning the spool and the spool is flinging pieces of this jellyfish off. It hit me in this arm a couple times, this arm here, under my nipple area, somewhat in my leg, and like it just started stinging, like something, it's still stinging. So I got pretty angry. I washed myself off, it, it, it didn't help, and no, I don't have anybody to, I really want peeing on me right now. The nine hook rig went to like a five hook rig after I got mad and threw it, now down to three. So it's pretty much what we were fishing with and normally. It is what it is. Keep fishing, never stop. Zach's about to be mad because there are surfers right in front of us. Uneventful day fishing. Everybody decided they wanted to surf in front of where my rods were at and they're still out there. Well, the servers are still out there. The baits aren't, but try again tomorrow. See what the rest of the day has in store. We don't have anything. We didn't catch anything to eat tonight. So what's going on? Good morning. Welcome to another day. Yesterday, like I said, did not end up too well because we, like it was just bad bad winds wrong wind direction water was really murky you know so we ended up just doing more playing than fishing but we're going back out there again today as you can see have all my rods got the sand spikes down there i don't know if y'all can see that but anyway i got them and we're gonna switch it up today doing a little challenge so today we are going i'm gonna challenge my girlfriend she can catch five fish any five fish that she wants and i will pay for dinner tonight no questions asked she already picked out a restaurant i saw her looking at it and it is seafood and it does look quite expensive she has just five fish any kind pompano whiting shark a big cobia it all counts so i'm gonna walk on down there bait on these mosquitoes i don't know what somebody tell me what kind of species of mosquitoes these things are these things are i stayed up all last night itching because of these things and of course she wants to start fishing bright and early so she can have a better chance of catching her five fish nah. so this is bad for fishing or excuse me bad for swimming but good for fishing i'm trying to read the surf out there haven't found a hole like that yet or i guess i'd say a rip keep on chucking forward enough to rig her up though so she does have hooks and a weight but you have to put on your own bait and you got to catch your own bait you got five fish can you put the things on no yes no i can put the, the you have to catch five fish all on your own oh yeah she feels bad about hooking sand fleas so looks like she's just using what i have left of the fish bite those five fish aren't looking too promising all right wes first cast wish me luck So what are what are you doing? Who is that? The time is 9 a.m. Her bait is in the water. No fish. Well, it's about 10 o'clock and she is still at it. This little guy came a little closer and she is right there fishing. Cameron is, I guess, giving her some pointers. So it seems as if she's going straight up fish bites. She has not found it any sand fleas and the little mud skippers the kids are just skipping around in the mud she's out there with no sand fleas the hat. I put it down to put the on and it's all gone your baits are gone yeah. oh that's fishing oh i'm like doing your crap 
Well, we're just sitting here drinking beer. <laughs> I've only had one, I promise. <sighs> I'm going to help this lady catch some mole crabs because she hasn't caught anything yet. I guess I'll help her out a little bit. All those little V's right there are mole crabs. Here we go. Got them. Um, Looks like she got one. Uh oh. One out of five. That's it. It counts. It counts. All right, four more. Good job, babe. Come here, Wes. Number two. She got the third fish. Number three. Fish number three. Two more to go for her. So we're back home. We'll tell you the whole story in a second. We're at that point of the trip to where you're out there in the sun, you're getting burnt, you're turning red, and everything just gets miserable. You don't want to turn a GoPro on. Rebaiting hook sucks. The kids are dragging their little butt cheeks. How many fish did you get? Three. She got three, so I won. Not yet. I'll give her a chance to still win tonight by night fishing if she catches two fish tonight. But tomorrow, if she catches, or tonight, if she catches two more fish to reach five before 12 o'clock, then I will buy her lunch tomorrow. Oh. Crab legs. Hush puppies. Fish of the day fish of yesterday but today let's see hot wings oh crab cakes right about the crab cakes fries chicken popcorn shrimp fries uh mozzarella sticks a little lonely hot dog crab dip spicy shrimp my mess salad Well, obviously the kids are tired, but the adults, I'm the only one that still stands or, or sits. Look at that meat. How can you retire from eating when you got like that sitting in front of you? Mm-hmm. There she is, the crab cone. That's good. My dentist hates me. <laughs> well guys, that's the end of this video. We obviously didn't go back out fishing because after all that food, we all just kind of <laughs> fell asleep and became couch potatoes. But that's okay, because that brings today, which is a whole new day. So we're gonna get into that video in a little bit. The water conditions have just been horrible. Like the wind's been blowing the wrong way. The first, 60, 70 yards of water has just been like milk chocolate. Fishing in that has just not been good. Today looks a little bit better. I did see two schools of bunker yesterday. I need to have a rig ready for those today. But I did see two schools of those and I saw bait getting blown up way past that murky water. There's fish out there. We're gonna see if we can do something different today. Stay tuned for that video. All right, guys. Check them out. Oh, there you go. Get them Okay, we're gonna smash it. Let's not smash it. Come here. 